Hello, my darlings. How are all of you? I've been thinking about you, and you know what? I kind of hold you here in my heart because I care about you, and I'm so glad we have this time together. <sighs> so thanks for being here. And uh, let me get straightened up. Oh, there. Um, I have a really cool book for you today. In fact, they call it a thriller. One Fox accounting book thriller. Do you know what a thriller is? Well, it's either a book or a movie or a series that you're like, <gasps> lots of tension. You're like, oh, I wonder what's going to happen. And you get really scared. And then I, I'm going to tell you already, it turns out fine. So don't worry about any of the characters in this book, okay? Because they all turn out fine. But it's scary in the meantime. So I'm just warning you that. So don't worry. It'll be okay. One Fox. And this is by Kate Reed. Just like reading a book. Spelled exactly the same. Kate Reed. One Fox. Accounting book thriller, she says. Look at that great fox head. Look. Does it look like I'm the fox? Well, didn't quite work, but, um, and look what she did on the back. I just love, I just love what um, writers and artists do with their books. I think these illustrations, which means the pictures, are some of the best illustrations ever. Look at our sweet fox. Hi, Foxy. Um, and then look at her, the end pages. Look at the, the footprints of the fox, all different colors. Good job, Kate Reed. Thank you for making such a beautiful book. Um, one Fox Accounting Book. Okay. One Famished Fox. Can you say that with me? One Famished Fox. Um, famished, do you know what that word is? It's a gray word. It means so hungry. Have you ever been so hungry? So hungry. So you might surprise the adults in your house by saying, I'm famished. <laughs> famished. 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 Okay, one famished fox. There is that famished fox. He's waking up and he's like, I'm so hungry. I'm famished. I am famished. So he's got to do something about it. He's got to go look for some food. So he's got his two sly eyes. Two sly eyes. It kind of rhymes. There's one, two sly eyes. Hi, Fox. Are you going to go find some food using your eyes to find it? Oh, and he sees three plump Hens. Uh-oh. Foxes love hens. There's, there's even a saying, the fox in the hen house. And that's a scary thing. So three plump hens. One, two, three plump hens. Mm. The plumper the better for the fox. Oh, and did you catch? They're, uh, they each, they're eating worms. Each one has a little worm in there in their eyes getting ready to eat because they need to eat too. Four padding paws. Let's take make our thing our, our hands pause. Four padding paws. I can't do my hind legs like this, but let's just do the four padding paws. And here's his or hers four padding paws. One, two, three, four, one getting ready to take a big long step. Look how long that fox is. Exciting. Okay. Five snug hens. So we go inside the chicken coop and there's five snug hens all snuggled up in there. And we've got, wait, I don't see five. Five snug hens? Well, there's three. 
One, two, three. Are they counting the eggs? Five snug. Oh! Five snug eggs. Oh. Okay, now let's count the eggs. One, two, three different colors. Four, five. Have you ever seen different colored eggs? Let's count them again. One, three, four, five. Oh, geez. I did read this book before I read it to you, but. Okay. Six silent steps. So the fox is six steps from the hen house. You ready? One, two, three, four. Five, six, and look at this illustration. There's the hen house, and somehow they make it with their imagination as they draw it, as she draws it, all wrapped around. And there's the six steps. One, two, three, four, five, six steps. And he's right at the door. There's the moon. Thrilling. Seven knocks at the door. It's almost like the big bad wolf, but this is the big bad fox. And there's tap, 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 tap. Seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Should we make that sound? Tap, tap, tap. Don't come in. Don't come in. Eight beady eyes. So there's the hens. There's the fox. Oh, scary fox. Let's count the eyes. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight beady eyes. Two really scary eyes and six very scared eyes. And then two more with mine. Nine flying feathers. Now, how are we going to count these feathers? I don't know. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine flying feathers. Have you ever been around chickens at all? And then if you've been around them and they suddenly just go, <sighs> um, it's something to hear and see and stuff. Okay. Ten sharp teeth. Yikes. He's like breathing in the feathers like we, we uh, see this count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten sharp teeth. Guess he's getting a little appetizer of the little feathers of the nine feathers. Ow! Oh my goodness! What in the world? Look what happened! All the hens from all around come rushing to the rescue. There's not even any words on this page. Just hens, hundreds of hens. Coming to help the hens in the... Uh -huh. Yes, 100 angry hens and... Oh, look. There's the fox running away as fast as he can. Here's the tip of the iceberg of all the 100 and We can't count all the 100, but we'll believe them, okay? Um, and they're chasing that fox away. And he's scared. Or she's scared. 100 angry hands and one frightened fox. Now who's frightened? One zoom frightened fox. And then, I love that's kind of the end of the story, but at the very end, we have all the footprints of the chickens, of the hundreds of chickens scaring the fox away. 
And the last words say, no hens or foxes were harmed in the making of this book. And I am very grateful for that. Are you? I am. So that gives us a great idea of, oh, and the very, the end pages are the hens sitting on their eggs and safe as can be. There's safety in numbers. Reminds me of protests when we all get together, no matter if there's somebody that's big and powerful, when we all get together, we can get anything done. So that's a wonderful uh, part of this story that there's safety in numbers and there's power in numbers. It's kind of like snowflakes, you know, snowflakes are like, oh, that's nothing. But when a bunch of snowflakes come and it's a blizzard and it's and it's an avalanche of a lot of snowflakes make for a lot of power. So it's exciting, isn't it? So I've heard that you guys like to say goodbye to me, and I'm so glad. Because even if I don't know it in the moment, because you're watching this at a different time than I'm reading, I feel it. I feel it. So I would like to spend just a moment saying goodbye. Thanks for being here. You mean a lot to me. There's only one of you like you in the entire world that ever has been or ever will be. You're really important to me. I'm so glad you're here. I'll see you next time. All right. Thanks for being here.